Hey guys, well, I just went to Pets at Home, um, and I got a few things, so I thought I'd make a video on it. Uh, so the first thing I have here is, it's called Super Hamster, uh, not Super, Super, no, it's spelled really weirdly, um, Super Dwarf Hamster Harvest. Now, I've been told this is actually really good for dwarf hamsters, and at the moment I'm just using normal standard Pets at Home Hamster muzzle, I think is how you uh, pronounce it. So what's it? It's got. It says it's got small seeds and dried me dried mealworms. And it says here, very sociable. They like to cuddle up together. Now dwarf hamsters generally aren't sociable at all. Um, so I, that's bad advertising. And the one thing I noticed in the car was if you look, I don't know whether you can see this. But there's a creepy picture of just some kid staring around the back which I thought was absolutely hilarious but it did creep me out the first time I saw it. Anyway, moving on. Um, oh, I almost dropped that. The next thing is, let me just take off this label. Okay, that failed but it doesn't matter. Um, just some small, small safe pet bedding. I think that's what it, yep. Now this is just uh, shredded kind of bits of tissue paper. But I use this for bedding, and this is really good for bedding, because if you don't know, you can't use cotton wool, as it if they eat it, it can get, basically clog up all their insides, to put it simply, and can cause some real problems, and this is swallowed, just completely disintegrates, and it's, they don't, um, they don't really eat it at all, um, and it's really cheap, it's only 99p for this bag, um, oh, if I didn't tell you, the food was about £2.99, so yeah. Uh, so I definitely recommend this. It's not none of the big brands like Carefresh or anything, but it really it's very cheap and it's really good. Next thing, uh, I got some fruit and veg chews. Now I've been eating some proper chews because at the moment I'm kind of just using block safe pet blocks of wood, which aren't the best, but they're not exactly bad. And um, so what we've got here it says this beats flossing. That's very funny. <laughs> Suitable for rabbits, guinea pigs, hamsters, rats, gerbils, and mice. Yeah, I said that right. Keeps teeth healthy and trim. No, keeps teeth trim and healthy. Healthily. Keeps teeth trim and healthily. Oh. Keeps teeth trim. I don't get that. I think you mean trimmed. But this is by Claw, uh, Gnaw and Craw. Claw Interaction. I cannot speak today. Um, and yeah, these are just some chews I picked up. These are used with pet safe vegetable dyes, so don't worry about that. But yeah, generally when I'm going to um, a shop like Pets at Home, I don't, I don't go for the big brands because normally they're more expensive and they are quality, but it, it, it's pe basically paying more and you don't need to pay more. Like. Uh, the bedding, for, for example, you could buy like Care Fresh, and this uh, this is only 99p. A bag of Care Fresh like bedding would have been, I don't know, a couple of quid, um, and it's cheap, and this is really good. So there's no point really in spending more. Now this I didn't get from Pets at Home, but I did get this from a local pet shop, um, and it's a very sort of strange thing. It's basically, where does it say? It's vegetable and vegetables and. Oh my god. Crunchy nibbles and vegetables, basically. Um, in this sort of layer of thing. It looks like marabone, but it isn't. Uh, I'll show you actually what it looks like. There you go. Interesting, I know. So yeah, I just bought some treats for Molly, because I haven't actually got many treats. Um, believe it or not, I've just been given her veg, so it's quite useful. Uh, now the next thing I have is a Christmas item. We have... Christmas sport, uh, small pet stocking, as you can see there. Now, this is quite cool. The thing is, though, they had dogs, dogs and cat ones, I think they had, and rabbit ones. And they all had this plastic outline. And I think the small pet one had um, had this wire outline. I didn't like that, but, you know, I can't really do much. I'm not going to open this. I'm just going to show you what's in it. Um, so what have we got? This thing here is... Fruit shapes, yummy treats for all small small animals, which I will be eating those. They they look quite good. Uh, the thing at the bottom, this one, they're chocolate drops, and it says yummy treats for all small animals again. 
but I will not be eating these because I do not really want to give Molly junk food. Um, sounds like I'm a parent, but I don't want to use those. So, um, I don't know. I'll give them to someone else. Uh, I don't know if you can see, but we've got a couple of tubes there at the bottom. Uh, this sort of rope thing, which looks quite cool. And this thing, I don't actually know what this is, but I think you put tubes in the holes and then they sort of try and get them out. I think that's what that is, but I'm not... Sorry, not tubes, you put treats in the holes. I think that's what that is, I'm not perfectly sure. But yeah, that's a bit of a Christmas item, so um, thank you for watching and come back next time.